Yes, sir. You already know it's your boy B Hayes. We back with another one, guys. Let's go ahead and jump right into it. Before we do that, let's give this video a thumbs up. So AMC, we trading at $35.41 at the time of this recording. We hit a low today of $35.35, guys. I know a lot of people probably out there worried, wondering, like, what's going on AMC? Is it over? Is it going to pop back? Should I sell my position? Should I take profits? All these different questions going around, and people is, you know, a bit worried. So you already know, guys, this is not financial advice. I'm not a financial advisor. I'm just sharing my thoughts and opinions what Hayes think was bound to happen. So I didn't expect, guys, for us to come down and be holding and trading at these levels in the 35 range, even though it's just a dollar and some change off from what I did expect. Worst case scenario, was around 36.50 right near support at 37.38 from there we expect the recovery back to the upside and this downward trend right now is just the you know test the waters trying to get short-term investors and day traders up out of their shares up out of their positions before taking this thing to the 50s because we've seen an easy ride to the 50s just a couple last week after breaking resistance at 38 48 then 40 then 43 in the same day we expect the easy ride straight to the 50s and i'm pretty sure a lot of short-term investors is th thought the same now that same thought process is the totally opposite now they're trying to hurry up and get out wondering you know is they did they make a bad decision about riding it to the 50 so you know that's you in between the rock and the hard place right now for them short-term investors and far as us guys we is in a position to where this how you're going to play it out if you one of the ones that been in amc for a while since the beginning you got in at nine dollars a share five dollars a share ten dollars a share and you still in the profits what you will want to do is now this is financial and this is not financial advice but i'm just saying something to help put you in a better situation to help you know give you better emotions about the whole thing you at least want to pull out your initial investment guys if you've been in on amc and with all this manipulation going on and everything that's happening right now and you you know you stuck in between if it's going to pull back to your average cost which i don't think it will but we never know what could possibly happen in the market i don't think it will but if you want to put yourself on the safe side i will pull my initial investment out and i will let the rest of my shares ride for free guys you get what i'm saying and, and for the naysayers in the back that say oh you're not a true eight if you do that this that and the third fuck y'all y'all don't pay nobody bills you get what i'm saying y'all don't do y'all don't do nothing for nobody only thing you worried about is yourself. So you feel me? And if you bad somebody for trying to help somebody, you know, put themselves in a better position to make sure they could, they good, and their kids good, and they didn't been in this whole ride this whole time for no reason at all. Because how would you feel? You up four hundred percent right now, three hundred percent, and then this thing take away that percentage, and you back right where you started from, and you ain't lock in nothing, and you've been holding it for a whole year. So I hope that makes sense for you guys. Go ahead and lock in your initial investment. That's easy. That's a piece of cake. Lock in that and let the rest ride. Even if you want to go a little further than that and take some profits to, 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 to reward yourself for this long, long wait, guys. Because nobody knows at the end of the day exactly what's bound to happen with this. But we do got strong, strong conviction that this thing is bound to happen, guys. It's bound to happen. And I mean, whenever you put yourself in a position where you're not even worried about the outcome of certain situations because you just align yourself up for every opportunity that take place everything like with sheba with doge with, with with all the stocks that's popping up to make easy money in and out cei we done made money off that several times and then then threw it away and forgot about it and we plotting on our next stock so if you set yourself up like that it's like you're not even worried about the outcome of amc because you running it up you running it up without amc so with that being said guys you just want to be smart and meticulous about you know the moves that you make at this point right here because right now they got us in a hot spot you know i ain't gonna lie i believe we good though me personally i think we're going straight back up a lot of buying pressure is going to come in people is going to eat up these cheap shares and especially if it want to follow up on the 30 and go to the low 30s it's going to be eating up guys i believe so and we'll be ripping right back off to the moon and the, the, the shifts of mood will change just like that but if that doesn't happen you want to prepare yourself guys just prepare yourself Pull your initial investment out, and then somebody say, you know, you telling all these people that you got to, you you got all the following, and and, and 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 these people might, you know, go off of what you said, and you might, I might bring it, they might think I'm bringing the stock price down because of what I just said. Believe it or not, guys, all the people that's watching my channel, would y'all rather be protected or would y'all rather worry about everybody else? Like, not even a, not even zero point five percent 
of the people that own AMC is going to watch this video. So whatever y'all do, don't worry about everybody else. Just focus on you and protecting yourself. You get what I'm saying? Because I'm not even putting an impact on 0.0.5% of the people that's investing in this stock. I'm just worried about you and the people that's, that's following me, trying to make sure you good. So I hope y'all understand that. We out. And I love y'all beautiful people. God bless you.